you know, there's some combinations of, of game that just, eh, they, they're, they're weird, right? You don't expect them to be something that can happen. Uh, this is Rungor, which is a, a real-time card game. <laughs> and, and those are the two mechanics. They are not sure how they're going to work. Uh, it's a real-time card battling roguelike game um and it's it's been in my my steam for uh like four months now and i have not checked it out and i want to check it out now let's play and see what's going on 194 very positive reviews on steam uh so high chance that that we we find ourselves a, a little gem here let's let's learn we're playing as night guy i got i got 50 um 50 health three to five attack and I got uh, the little paperclip from Windows XP talking to me. Hello. Running forward is cool, but you know what's even cooler? Is it using the Binding of Isaac upheaval font uh, as your font in your game? <laughs> Sorry, I, I know the font because I've used it 100,000 times in thumbnails. Um, for example, Cold-Blooded Murder. Okay. Cool. So we are here. Battles happen automatically, so don't worry about them too much. Uh, he's going. He's having a good... Good auto battling time right now. And he has defeated his enemy. What a great scenario. Hey, this is the, the cursed deck drop some cards. Awesome. You can pick up some of them for the next battle if you feel like killing an enemy isn't enough. So I have three attacks where I can do four damage. Uh, and I have a, an armor. I'm going to tell you it seems that the attacks are pretty, pretty straightforward. Give me the armor. I can choose more. Give me the attacks. <laughs> That sounds fine. That sounds great. Okay, I guess I'll add a couple of cards for you. Holy crap. Use as many cards as you want. Turn your enemies into a bloody mess. Grind their bones to dust. More blood for the blood god. Holy. Okay, um, I'm going to obliterate you, if you don't mind. You've been destroyed. I'm prepared. Choose some more cards. I mean, I'll... I'm gonna take more more block because we we attack automatically for four, right? So give me some block since you're hitting me for five. Give me some block since you're hitting me for five. Give me some block since you're hitting me for five. I walk away with a little win, okay? Did you notice that your health went up? Um, yes, that's because I'm healing. <laughs> that's because your starting artifact, every hero has one. Tries its best, so be grateful. Okay, so you are healing 20% of my, my max HP. Hey, look at that! This teddy bear really wants to show you all of his stats. How nice of him, to be honest. Um, how inappropriate. I will move this window so it doesn't distract you. Okay, but if you are into it, you can just drag your cursor to the right side of the screen. Very cool. Very cool. So you got 50 health, 4 attack. Um, I don't know what your 0, .0, 0 seconds is here. But he mutilates me if I play a card. And after 5 seconds, he gives up. Okay, um... I mean, I'd prefer he doesn't mutilate me, so I'm just gonna do nothing since he doesn't attack me, right? His attack, that's what the every 1.5 seconds is, so I just don't play cards. This was a, a case of, can the player read? Uh, unfortunately, you caught me on a good day. I can read today. Congrats on defeating the boss. Now you have some more levels to do. Okay, bye bye <laughs> Okay, bye bye <laughs> See you later. Have a good one. Sure, I'm with it. Um, very interesting. It's a me. Stop in time again, just because I can. Want to see something awesomely cool? Click this. Okay. Oh my god, just look at all of these. Ability to wear equipment only for one monies? That's a steal. Okay, uh, I will. Bunch of things going on here. Playing cards with number keys. Feels like that's probably something that should be in the game by default, but that's fine. Um, bullet time on, on right mouse button seems very interesting. Give me the equipment, okay? Congrats, now you're even more prepared to murder. Okay, bye 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 Okay, see you later. So, I got some quests. Um, kill five bosses, um, artifacts, stack 10,000 armor seems like, it seems like quite a bit, to be fair. Um, and then go back to the main menu. So I'll play as Night Guy. There's apparently, a, like, a good chunk of characters in this game. I'm trying to... Oh, by the way, when you click out of the game while recording it, it gets really, really kind of glitchy, which I think is cool. Um, I'm not sure if it's intended with, with OBS. I was mainly trying to look in the Steam page and see... Um, sorry, 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 we're good. <laughs> Looking on the Steam page to see how many characters there are. Um, but there's quite a few, so different experiences to be had. Night guy, let's 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 do it. Um, we've done the tutorial, so so you know what? Put me in the jungle, baby. Welcome to the jungle. 
They got a forgotten road and a forgotten forest. No one remembers where it leads to expected income to the jungle. Okay, sorry. The expected income we get here is $58. Um, we don't know where it leads to. Sorry, I got, I got stuck in Guns N' Roses for a second. So, you're just attacking me for one. I think that we we are very happy to just put some block on um, and then let him kind of kind of live his life. So, I get new cards every combat. Yo, is that an equipment piece you found? Equipment is just like cards, uh, but it stays with you until the end of the level and gives a permanent effect, so not like cards at all. Interesting. So, attacks an enemy gives an attack card. That's pretty cool, I think. Uh, I also like the high armor. This applies mark. Mark, the target takes 25% more damage. And then this is a, a weapon that's going to increase my attack by one. Interesting. Okay. Um, I kind of like this card. Because it's the ability for me to cycle a card really quick. But my deck also... So do I continue... The, these are my base cards. Do I continue to... Uh, I mean, you can see all the cards here. Do, do we continue to, to, to get more cards? I don't know exactly how that works yet. Um, I do think that there's value in like an eight armor card. I can choose three, so I guess I'll take all of these. I keep on thinking I only get one. So we're fighting the monkey. Um, he buffs my attack? Question mark? That seems illogical. I'm going to hit you to, to get some, some more stuff flowing, and I'm going to kill you so I don't take any damage. Possibly, I mean, a little, little weird. One of the voices in your head, is this game too difficult? Let me help you a little bit. Give me, give me plus one damage for five battles. Um, I'm filled with determination. Undertale reference, I'll keep running. Okay. Dude, very interesting little game. I, I like the, the auto battler style that still provides me with a little bit of, a little bit of juice, right? Attacks give armor really good give an armor card if the enemy is marked give another gives four armor upgrades after each play that's kind of cool too so so give me these attacks giving armor for four seconds i i think is cool so we're gonna pop this and then attacks giving armor is unfortunately not very good i have to play all my cards because that bomb is gonna blow up and destroy me so we're fighting a box um, this fearsome enemy has no abilities, doing 0 to 24 damage. Quite a bit. Quite a bit. Um, attacks giving armor. I still think it's good, man. I think it's good. Increasing attack speed for 6 seconds also I think is good. Just just give me these. I've, I've stacked my deck filled with far too much, I think. Um, but now every attack I do is... I mean, that's so busted, man. <laughs> That is so strong. And then we just body you. Okay. Choose an artifact. 50% chance for attack to crit. Armor gain increased by 100%. I mean, this is a no-brainer, right? Because any armor gain increased by 100%, that's, that's huge, man. That's absolutely huge. So, attacks an enemy if he's marked, attack more. Attack an enemy and apply mark. Or just an armor card. I love the idea of just having armor... Slowing down the enemy, also cool, but I, d I don't mind the attack increase. I think I'm going to take this mark, and then I'm just going to... I have to add cards, huh? I see, I see, okay. That changes the way that you think about this game, for sure. Um, I'm happy with these. Let's, let's keep the ball rolling, okay? Let's keep the ball rolling. Floor two of two. We, we got armor. It'd be cool if I could pause, um, but I know that that's... That's kind of against the the reality of the game. I shouldn't have played that one card. I mean, maybe we'll get it again. Um, double your current armor. Attack an enemy and then add armor equal to damage? Bro, these cards are crazy. Like, they're so good. There's a 14 damage card with 28 armor, and then I'll double it for 84. Like, I'm, I'm never taking damage. <laughs> You're going to tag me for as much as you want. I'm never getting hit. And then I can save these for the future. Increase attack for four seconds. Suddenly discover a unique talent of cloning cards in your hand with only your willpower. Uh, I would like to think to the right and get two more of those. And then we're going to go kind of crazy with those against the boss. So double, 
Give me 12 armor, and then these boots are increase attack by 2 for 1 second. I think I'd rather increase the attack by 8. And then an application of mark makes this hand, like, really, really good. So we're going to mark you. Then we're going to hit you. That's going to kill you. Now we're fighting the package, which is a little bit more interesting than the box, I suppose. Um, I mean, look, this is... This is just absurd. Uh, get Berserk until the end of battle and add some armor. 100% attack speed, but Hero takes 50% more damage. I have so much armor, man. This is going to be fine. So pop everything and then armor me two times me to an Oblivion and you're just going to die. I mean, I, I can attack you. It, it doesn't really matter. You're, you're, you're toast, my guy. You're absolute toast. You can hit me for as much as you want. I got 284 armor. So I, I think I'm going to be okay. So thanks for the victory. Um, I think we did fantastic, really. Move me into the graveyard. Let's let's keep this this fun, fun plans going. Much corpses around here. Hopefully you won't become one of them. Expected income 90. Sorry, I was going to make a Guns N' Roses joke, but I think that that train... I think that, that train has passed. I was gonna make another one right there. What are we doing? Um, apply mark. That's fine. Make this guy uh, take a little bit more damage. We didn't have any any block in hand. I probably should have done something there. This increases attack for five seconds. Attack an enemy. Add armor. I mean, let's let's mess around with some mark this time around. I can do a little attack increase as well. So apply mark. And then, I mean, really, we want to kill you pretty quickly. So that's that's fine. It's great. Um, replenish HP to full. We, I mean, we're at full. <laughs> like we're doing just fine. How about give me plus one damage for five battles, and then and then we'll keep running here. I'm chill with it. Increase attack speed. Give armor. Give armor. Um, I'd like to do these. A base attack, man. I'm just. I know that I should be interested, but I'm I'm just not at all. Like, we, we should kill you without spending any cards. There's a little bit of, of quickly analyzing the position and seeing if you're screwed or not. And we were not there. But we will go kind of crazy in, in these boss fights. So mark me, increase my attack speed. Let's put some block on, because you're going to start hitting me. And then, I mean, really just send it. Let's... Let's do maximum amounts of damage to you. That went fine. Artifact. It's the Ankh. Give reincarnation with 50% HP. Mark targets take 50% more damage. On block, apply mark to the attacker and deal damage equal to the hero's attack. That's... That's kind of spicy. <laughs> that's kind of spicy, but let, let's do this, right? We, we have this weird marked run going. I mean, this is... I mean, it's actually just crazy, right? I think that that's brilliant. I'm, I'm playing a little bit... I mean, we're just trying to do a different build than before. I don't think that the build that I'm making is intelligent. I'm going to tell you that. Uh, but I I think that it's fun. So that's why I'm doing it. Like, th this is this is definitely worse <laughs> than before. But I like it. Attack, slow down the opponent. Uh, apply mark. We love it. And give an armor card if the enemy is marked, give another. So we're going to... We're going to mark you. Take a card. I'm going to put a little bit of block on. You're going to die. I don't know how easy this is for you to follow, but... Um, there's an interesting line of thinking that I'm taking with it. You see a graveyard keeper at work, but is he burying something or digging out? I'll help him bury. You almost buried the graveyard keeper himself. He smashed your face with a shovel. I'm stunned for the next five seconds. That's kind of messed up, in all honesty. Attack slowed down by, by 30%. I'll upgrade you. And then we do a mark. And then if if mark, then keep going. There's so much going on here. So mark ya. Give me some, some block. And give me some block. You, you're being very annoying. Um... I'm just gonna kill you because you're doing some some jank things and I think I'm poisoned or something like things things went kind of haywire there so give me these and and give me this we're going into a boss fight we're, we're just going to pop 
all of this shield. Um, and then let's apply Mark. Let's hit ya. Gives an armor card if the enemy is marked. Give me more. I'm about to take 40. Um, now I'm taking 80, which is horrifying. I'm dying. You're dead. Okay, that was very scary. <laughs> very scary. Reduce max HP by 30%, but restore 4 with each attack. I don't think that we want to do that. 50% chance for attack to crit. Let's send it. That was a lot scarier. Um, obviously, things did not go according to plan. Um, double armor. Gives armor, but makes you lose it after 5 seconds. Don't really like that. Let, let's do this. This upgrades after each play of it. And we'll go a little deeper in the damn graveyard, my guy. So, floor 3 of 3. Keep the good times rolling. I'm going to get some, some block flowing. We don't have a lot, to be fair. Um, I'm going to pop this armor card. We, we do not have a lot of juice in the tank, my guy. Um, things are... They're a, little, they're a little spicy right now. They're a little spicy. So, you're a 30%er. That means that I'm going to take these. <laughs> I don't love them. Okay, I don't love them. But pop this immediately. I mean, that's just a great card to have to get extra extra block out of it. You're dead. They're, oh, you're, they're alive again. I will... I'm going to kill you. Okay, I was going to say, I don't want to do... I don't want to do too much work against you. An intelligent-looking zombie offers a game a Russian roulette. Sure, let's do it. Bam, the zombie shot himself. I just really like this game. I can't stop, says the zombie. You won an artifact. Okay, 25% chance to block damage. That's crazy good. <laughs> that was a really, really good uh, artifact to have. So this is Berserk. We can't take you. Attack and stun the enemy. Increase max HP. Next card, attack card, will be played three times. Interesting. Um, really busted play here. So let's do this. And we're going to stun you. I mean, we stunned you three times. But it was the same... It was, like, effectively the same. I, I think that that was actually that was not very useful at all. So, mark me. Mark. I guess you're already marked, right? So, let's do these. I think we're dead. I'm going to tell you right now. You attack every, th every three seconds. We need to mark you immediately. And then hit you. Increase your attack speed. I don't have any way to double my current armor. Um, dude, I think we're toast. Like, we, we have to bank on the 25% chance happening, like, a bunch. I can't double my armor. I'm dead. <laughs> okay. Well, I'll tell you what we've learned. Uh, the armor runs are, like, way better. <laughs> They're way better. So, we're going to try again, but I, I want to take a look. So, yeah, I mean, we're, like, not even close to getting any of those, but I can buy these now. So, more card choice, sure. I can do that multiple times. Card sorting, I can just move them around, sure. I mean, I'll take more card choice. Oh, more equipment, this would be way more useful. Oh, dude, look at how much other stuff there is. Okay, um, yeah. <laughs> yeah, we should save up for those, for sure. But, send me in. Um, We'll do graveyard again, and, and hope to... Hope to succeed. I'm going to build a run that actually wins instead this time, which I know you're going to be like, sure you are, Tyler. But like, no, we, it definitely, it was in the better for us to run a block build for sure. So give me these. Um, the thing is like, a, an attack and apply mark is still, that's still decent. You're going to hit me for, for six. I'm gonna pop this one, you're gonna hit me. Okay, I think I think I'm gonna kill you with that. That seems fine. We increase attack for, for four seconds. What do we got here? While I was running past some shady character, they managed to sell me a loot box. Look, I'm not much, I'm more of a, a GCP kind of guy than, a, than an Azure guy. Give me the Aquamarine loot box. Free attack cards, that seems fine. I will definitely not remember that in the future. So, a lot of options here. 
Um, I don't need Mark, but we do have a, a Mark synergy here. So I'll, I'll take these cards and then we'll, we'll go a little Mark heavy in this fight, okay? I can stun you. I don't think I need to, which we love. <laughs> Went great. And then a Gargoyle boss. I would like this. These times twos are huge. Um, and some armor that upgrades is also good. So I do have a mark. Um, let's let's do that and then just immediately dupe these. I'm going to stun you. I'm going to increase some attack speed for a little bit. And then I'm just going to watch you. Um, probably going to i'm gonna i'm gonna kill you okay i didn't i didn't like where that was going armor gain increased by 100 percent is i mean it's just insane right it's so good so give me you times two on the armor give an armor card if the enemy's marked give another give me give me these stuns instead uh there was also there there was something on this enemy that i'd like to look at i can't look on the right oh no okay um stun him please Apply mark. You're gonna hit me for five. I'm I'm not concerned about this fight, but just chill for a sec. We're gonna heal to full just fine. Hey, you're close to full. I'm I'm chill with close to full. I'm gonna help to bury again because that that gave him. Oh no, that smashed me in the face. I I was thinking about the damn uh, gun. Okay, so we will not help him bury in the future gives armor makes you lose it after five seconds i like you i like you i like another stun no i like this yeah i'm i'm chill with that we're gonna pop this immediately because this is just a valuable play um some basic attacks on you the stun on me made that a little bit more annoying um i don't have any way to mark you unfortunately i'd like to kill you you come back to life, I kill ya. You come back to life, I I kill ya. Like please, you come back to life. I'm I'm not wasting any cards at this point. Like that was a little unfortunate, but I I gotta I gotta stand my damn ground, man. So give me this 16 that upgrades. I think we do want some mark plays. Um, this is just a worse version of that. So so give me this. Okay, I'm marking. I'm gonna pop a, a just pop some some simple simple things here. I'm gonna oh the times two was not useful. Give me give me 16. I hate it, but the 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 14. You're dead. Okay, okay, okay. Not too bad. Double his damage with each attack. I probably should have been reading some of this. A key probably for opening something. Okay, yeah, I'm taking that. <laughs> like, for sure. Increase attack by 15 for 5 seconds, and if I don't win, I die. I mean, that's... That's interesting, for sure. I'd prefer to just, like, not do that, believe it or not. So, apply mark and then give me some of this armor so that I can kill you. You're you're a boss, so I'm, I'm going to spend all my cards. I'm a pretty simple guy. We have, like, no attack, man. We got no attack. I'm keeping the key because uh, hopefully you're going to drop, like, a, a big old chest or something. I died. I think he has piercing, and that was the issue. <laughs> Which is fair. Um, just a hungry guy has been unlocked. So, I mean, that's kind of cool. Can we can we take a look at, at who the hungry guy is? We, we've killed a boss. That has unlocked a hungry guy. Um, oh, he's over here. I didn't know I could scroll the screen. Holy crap, dude. A lot going on. Hello, hungry guy. The more HP he has, the faster he attacks. I mean, you gotta try, right? Send send me back into the graveyard. Let's let's go kind of crazy here. He's just a hungry guy. You got brand new cards. Um, I gotta learn what they do. Apply maim. I mean, look, I'm just gonna let you kind of vibe for a little, my guy. You're attacking Flowey from Undertale. I, I need to I need to learn about you. Your leftmost card is acting up. What are you gonna do? My leftmost card. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna destroy it because I'm a little freak. Card was torn apart into to smaller pieces. Okay. You're gonna immediately put me back into another fight. No, not yet. Okay. So what do we have in our deck? We start with restore HP and apply maim. 
Maim increases incoming damage by one. Increases incoming damage. So that's to the enemy. Gotcha. And then our artifact is we have 2% more attack speed for every HP. Okay. Um, it's interesting. 40% chance to apply extra maim. Kind of cool. Deal damage to self. So we, we want heals, right? So give me these. I mean, attack twice, I guess, is fine. Gives me bananas after death. Sure. Keep in mind that we, we don't heal. So this becomes... Um, it becomes kind of kind of spicy. We need to balance our, our heal plays a little bit better. This character is, uh, is different, for sure. It's definitely different. So I would lose my 40% chance to apply extra main, but I would increase my max HP. I'm going to tell you, I think that that's better. And then applying two maim is also good, and an attacks that restore HP I think is fantastic. So apply some maim. More max HP just means I attack faster, man. So it's it's a no-brainer. You you have to take that. On battle start, recover four HP. Those are shoes. I mean, you can absolutely take those. Apply maim to all enemies. It upgrades with each use. That's fine. And then a nice balmy, uh, nice balmy eight heal. I'm chill with it. So you're getting maimed. Give me an increase to my attack speed. It's now like kind of kind of wacky. And then all I have to do is keep up with my heals a little bit. I do wish that my attack speed was a little, or my, my damage was a little better, but I mean, you, you, you're gonna die. You got another hit on me, which is kind of annoying, but you, you died. Give a card after every 25 HP is lost or gained. Reincarnate, 33% chance to make a bonus attack. Um, I think this is this is really good. So I'm I'm gonna take that. All of them are okay. 40% attack speed plus 20% for every maim on enemies for five seconds. That's a great card. And then more maim. Restore an HP every second plus one for every maim on enemies. I like you too. So you go a little maim crazy. We go a little maim crazy. I like the ideas. I do. So maim ya. And then give me, look at the attack speed freaking sand, dude. Holy lordy, is that good. Enjoyed that a lot. You met the Lich, the king of all dead in some random creepy crypt. Um, I'm going to pretend I'm a door-to-door -door salesman. He bought whatever I was selling. Cool, I got some gold. We love that. <laughs> we love that for me. Um, these are better boots. We, we love that. Uh, make hero attack when he takes damage for four seconds. Now, I'm going to take some, some nice heals, uh, and then another one of these cards, which I think is is very good. Now, I have to figure out how to get more maim on these guys. That's that's really our, our big kicker right now. I'm going to treat it as whenever I get a free card. Give me the key. Um, whenever I get a free card from, from this, I just get to use it. That's probably not an intelligent way to do that, but... I do like it. <laughs> I do like it. Um, I'm really interested in the key, man. So, maim me, and then go. More maim on you. And then this, I mean, this just increases. I shouldn't have used it. I shouldn't have used it. That was the boss. No, we're moving into the boss. Or was... No, I think we're moving into the boss. That's crazy. We're, we're going for all of the maim, and then some HP restoration boss fight let's do it maim goes on and then just start popping these it's gonna keep our attack speed very high increase max hp by 10 damage hero for 10 self damage increases i don't care just oh no i cared i cared you killed me <laughs> okay he got me um hit me with a retry dude this game's kind of cool um it's unique right it, it definitely has a it's got an interesting vibe. I, I wish that I could, like... I know that that's the point, but I wish that I could slow down. Um, just so that I can make some decisions and explain, like, what I'm doing. Because I, I feel like... I feel like you're not... It's going to be hard to follow this game. Um, but I suppose we'll see. I'll be interested to see what you guys think about it. I like the idea of a, of a main build. There, there's some really interesting... Uh, 
interesting ideas with Mame here that we can build some some fascinating runs, I think. So there's my bananas that I got. Um, give me these nice heals. I really don't care about attacks, man. Although maybe I do because our attack is so low. I, I think that that's, that's potentially fair. But you're dead. We, we keep going, we keep going. Little gargoyle boss incoming. Give me maim. I like this card a lot for the extra, extra attack speed. And then honestly, uh, that's just a nice card to have. So we're maiming. Maim, maim, 100% attack speed. And then start restoring the HP per maim as well. That keeps us nice and stable. You're going to kill me. I'm going to... I'm going to crank my, my HP. I feel like using all of my cards on boss one is not a good way to handle things, man. Raise max HP by 50%. You gotta take that. We got 90 HP right now. It's pretty good. Triple attack, deal 5 damage to self. Apply maim to me, restore HP. I don't like it. Um, I think I'm just taking these three, and I hate that. <laughs> I think those are pretty standard cards, but I, I don't like hitting myself in this fight. Uh, I understand the benefit, but I'm, I'm really not the biggest fan. I'm using all of those immediately because I, uh, I don't know. I, I think that, I think we need to focus on just kind of going crazy. I will do this. You shot yourself? He gave me a revive. Okay, I mean, that's not the end of the world, actually. Give me this nice two maim, this and this, and then we're, we're going to play him. <laughs> this, this is such an annoying enemy because of the revive, so I'm, I'm going to fight you and, and do things accordingly. The thing is, like, the higher our HP, right, the more attack speed we have, so I, I got to keep our HP just cranked to the oblivion. You upgrade with use. I mean, all of these upgrade with use. Give me, give me these. We're gonna go heavy again on this. I'm, I'm just playing my cards. I, I wanna, I wanna keep our HP as high as possible so that we can, we can kind of manage accordingly. So give me this. Give me this. But I would need to get maim on you. You double your damage with each attack. You're so annoying. You're so annoying. Okay. Um. At that point, this is better. This gives two cards. Those cards could be maim. My issue is I'm like not getting any maim here. Um, but I also think that we need the the heal. So I think you have to do you have to do this, and then we start out by applying maim, and then you you pop both of these immediately, and that way we're healing a little bit, um, and we're we're cranking at the same time. I think we're dead. Um, <laughs> you, you will hit me for 40 here. I do have a revive. Um, I mean, having 90 is amazing, but you're going to kill me. <laughs> Dude, I don't know how you beat that. I don't know how you beat that. That was, uh, that was tough. I mean, even with the revive, that is, that is very hard. Only 60% through. I'm going again, okay? I'm going. Uh, this hungry guy, he must live. He must live. It's just so much going on, man. It's one of those games, like, it's in the same class as, like, a, a Crypt of the Necromancer. We've taken so much damage. Holy crap, I'm gonna die to the first enemy. Okay, um... Probably wanna do something here. Chance to apply extra maim. Restore some HP, I guess. I mean, you're gonna restore some HP immediately, um, cause you're... You're in tough shape. <laughs> Like very, very tough shape. You don't have maim on you, so playing this is... I mean, I guess it heals one. I'm gonna die. Um, I I can't compete against you. You you will kill me here? Yeah, you're gonna kill me here. I just don't have any... I don't have any plays. I... Yeah, I appreciate the lull. You got me. You got me. Try me again. I feel like that we just got, like, a, a bad roll, man. It's tough when you can't, you don't have any maim in your hand, so you can't do any extra damage, and the sucker only hits for two. 
It was just a tough play. Very tough play. Uh, recover 2 HP on battle start. I mean, maybe we go for something crazy here. Apply maim to me. To restore HP. I don't think that's a smart play at all, because now your ass is hitting me for two each time. And my re your your regening is it's a lot. I'm at 32. I don't love it. I really don't love it. Um, let's throw a tea party, see what happens. He likes my company, he gives me some of my power. Increase my damage by one. Adds an empowered version of this artifact to the pool. Increasing my damage by one could be all we need to survive this, I'm gonna tell you. So maim and a heal, and frankly, an attack for twice eight is pretty good. So maim, I'm gonna heal real quick. You're going to kill him, beautiful, okay. We're in good shape against the gargoyle, I think. So give me a heal, give me a heal. Give me an increase in attack speed as well. So, maim, maim, heal, heal. And then I'm, I'm gonna chill for a couple seconds. Okay, I'm gonna play the rest of my cards because I'm I put maim on you at the very end, which is not useful. <laughs> okay, uh, it wasn't, wasn't great, I'm gonna tell you. You gotta, attack supply maim is so good. That's crazy. Um, raising max HP by 50%, also crazy. That is really good. But attacks apply maim, man. Oh my lord, it's way too good. And then a 60% chance to apply extra maim. We're, we're all in on heals. The maim is going to carry us. We, we should be generating a lot of maim at this point. So just keep your healing high. Just, just keep it all the way up. L look at this, you already have six maim on you, my guy. Okay, you already have six maim on you. Eight maim on you. It's crazy. It's really, really good. Okay, um, that's beautiful. Attacks have a 20% chance to apply maim on top of that my attacks apply maim. I don't know if you can get an additional, but that's obviously insane. <laughs> so now give me, I mean, just give me another maim, I suppose. And then you're going to regenerate a ton of HP. I mean, this is this is destruction now. You get the perfect combo, things go crazy. Um, I'm fine with this. Zombie shot himself, which gives me 25% chance to block damage. I think that's okay. I don't think it's amazing, but I think it's okay. Give dodge. Hero is invulnerable. I mean, that's that's really solid. Um, this is an absurd... <laughs> actually, just absurd. I think I want to just dodge your attacks for a little bit. No, that's like not the right play, dude. You dodge when this guy's about to attack. Don't be dumb, Tyler. Don't be dumb. It's obviously a terrible play. Um, you should You should yell at me for that. I'll accept your yelling. Um, now... We take this. You take the dodge back. You're gonna you're gonna do this correct <laughs> this time. Give me the the restoration of heals. And now now we wait. You can hit me for five. I don't mind. Um, I am going to stack these. You can hit me. Uh, you're just gonna die. Okay, that went extraordinarily well. Increase damage by twelve. Um. I think this is actually better than that. This is really good, man. It's really good. But I think that this is better because a third of the time you're going to hit again, which is has a chance to apply even more uh, maim. Right? Is this intelligent? This might just be better. The more maim you have is already going to increase your damage by 12, though. This is better in long fights. This is better in short fights. I could go crazy and just take the Ankh. <laughs> that, might, that actually might be the most intelligent play. Because I think our damage is fine. Um, but that's not fun. I think this is the most fun. So I'm going to take that. I, I acknowledge that it might not be the best play. Um, but I do think it's the most fun. Maim all enemies deal 10 damage to me. I really don't think we want to be hitting ourselves at all with this character. 
Like I understand that there's an archetype there, but we don't have we don't have a healing archetype. I'm dodging. I'm dodging. Ooh, that's get two dodges out of that. We love it. Kill him. He's got some onks. Um You're hitting for eights, you're dead. Pretty clean. Pretty clean. I feel I feel a little bit of hope, okay? Just a little bit. Make hero attack when he takes damage. Apply maim. Obviously, that heal is crazy. Um, defeat him in under five seconds to get a bonus event. All right. Yeah, I'll humor it. I'll humor it. Give me, give me this then, and then uh, let's pop him. Okay, I've done it. <laughs> give me the bonus. <laughs> give me the bonus event. You loot the graveyard keeper. Uh, I'm gonna take a shovel. Shovel is a attacks have a 20% chance to to stun. Um, I just killed the graveyard keeper, so I don't think he's at work. But I'm gonna help to dig him out. I dug up a very angry monkey, and he ran away leaving his shovel behind. I already have his damn shovel. Give me it again, coward. I want the shovel again. I'm mad. I'm very mad. Um, give me give me these. Big, big monkey, I'm not concerned about, okay? There, there are very, very few concerns with this large monkey. He has been bested relatively fast. Okay. Um, great card. Good enough card. Dodges is, is openly crazy if you can pull it off correctly. Um, so give me, give me this. You don't revive, um, but you do have this extra, extra wave. I do not feel any fear against you. And now we have the final boss, a zombie. Revive with lower stats. I'm taking the key. Attack steal HP is really good. Um, and then this is obviously very strong if we need it. Yeah, I, I think I like it. Um, you go all in, right? You go all in. So attack you. We do have a for every maim on enemies play. But let's let's kill you first. I mean, you got 32 maim on you. I'm gonna I'm just gonna body you. <laughs> that was just obliteration. That was obliteration. Okay, we love it. Thanks for the gold, baby. We we, we appreciate you. Five artifacts in one run. But what what are the two two uh, lumps of iron on the top? I got two out of eight uh, lumps of iron. Seemingly, as we continue, we will we will uncover more. But uh. Got some stuff going. Defeat Minigun Gobble in town. I'd love to. I really would love to. Bet on zero and win. Okay, I don't really know what that means. But give me um, give me an equipment. I'd like to buy... Attack Supply Mark. Increase attacks. These are weapons for, for certain characters. Um, I don't know who any of you people are. Give me, give me this. Give me this. Just to get some new things in the in the game, right? And then uh, we'll keep time going. I mean, this seems very fun, to be fair. The ability to slow down time a little bit would make this game a lot more interesting, I think, for you to watch. But hey, um, that's going to do it for now. It's a really interesting game, man. I, I actually enjoyed this one a lot. Um, I think there's some really unique mechanics in kind of that auto battler style in this game, uh, and I'm I'm excited to potentially play some more if you're you're interested, because uh, I mean clearly there's there's a lot more to play when you actually look at the look at this, right? I mean you can tell it's gonna snake all over the place. So more to see. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed, as always, liking the video, much appreciate. I'll see you in the next one. Have a good rest of your day. Bye bye.